Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Crystal Reports contains three functions which evaluate the status of the alerts within a report. These functions all return a true value or false value, so it's returning a Boolean value used for evaluating the status of alerts. You can use these functions to determine whether or not an alert's been activated. So you can select the formula fields and then click New in the Field Explorer to create one of the fields. And you give it a name and then just click Use Editor. In the Functions pane, you can expand the Alerts folder to see the three different functions. Is alert enabled determines if the enabled checkbox is checked for an alert. Is alert triggered determines if the record being evaluated is triggering the alert. And alert message just returns the message or the formula typed into the message text box for the alert. And any alerts in the report are shown in the alerts names subfolder. So for example if I wanted to create a field that simply showed if the record being evaluated is triggering the alert, I could double click as alert triggered to add that to the formula text box and then double click on the name of the alert. Check my syntax and save and close. I can then add that into the actual report. And then when we preview it, well, there are low sales figures. And any record that says true is being triggered by the low sales. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.